So here is a medusa. It's going to be our example of a pup growing out of the base of the roots. As you can see, whenever I go to turn it here, that leaf that's coming up off the mother plant is acting as a little hold and a protection to keep that pup stable as it continues to grow. Others will form at the base of the leaves. So on this stricta here, you can see as I zoom in, there are two little pups growing in between the leaves right there. And one reason air plants do this is those bottom leaves help to support the pups as they grow. So on average, your air plant will produce between two to eight pups, and those pups will continue to obtain nutrients from the mother plant as she finishes out her life cycle. So when is it safe to remove the pups from the mother plant? Generally speaking, you're gonna to wanna to wait until the pups have reached the size of at least one third to half the size of the mother plant. This is just to make sure that they are still obtaining all the nutrients that she has left to give. Sometimes it can take up to generations for the mother plant to fully die off and completely stop giving out nutrients. So the next question is, is how do you remove the pups? Before we get into how to remove them, I just wanted to quickly add in an example of pups that are too small to be removed. So on this rubber here, she has produced a lot of pups and they are not quite ready to be removed, but you will see a good size here in just a second. As you can see here, the mother plant is in my right hand and the pup is in my left, and this is a good size to remove them. You could still leave them together because that mother plant isn't completely hasn't completely died off yet so if you wanted to you could still leave them but I'm just gently holding them in each of my hand and twisting pulling until they are separated so here is a great example of a mother plant that is completely given all of her nutrients out to the pups and is ready to be removed she is the very brown um, air plant there in my hand as you can see also, this has been generations that have bloomed out, produced their own pups, and I would say that they are ready to be detached from their mother. So again, just holding the pup or the pups in my left hand and using my right hand to wiggle the mother plant out. And this one was a little bit difficult, so I had to get a little bit more firm. But again, this does not hurt them. That mother plant is already way done with her life cycle and it's not really gonna negatively affect the pups in any way if you have to get a little bit rough, but there she is, and I'm just kind of going back through and cleaning up any extra dead leaves that she might have left behind. And here is the final result after I removed the rest of those leaves that she had left behind. So that's gonna wrap up today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. As always, all of our socials and our website are linked down in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope you guys have an amazing day.